Hello, everybody. Welcome back to more into the Gungeon. Lich Streaks. I wanted to go crazy with it, but then I had to stop myself halfway through that because uh, completely unintelligible for the people who are brand new to the series. Welcome. We're on a streak of either 200 or 211, depending on how self-conscious you are. Let's hit our D8 right here. We got ourselves a three. That's the... One, two... That's the gunslinger. I'll take that. I, I, oh boy, I'll take it. It's been, a, it's been a doozy of a past few days. So a nice little... A nice little gunslinger is exactly what the doctor ordered. Oh, baby, that's going to be nice. I mean, that being said, I could embarrass myself. It could be the absolute worst case scenario because it could be a run where we we're going to... We're destined to lose regardless. Which I don't think they... I don't know. What what run would we actually be destined to lose? Really? Are we laying on turbo? No, my brain's just slow. All right. But alas, <laughs> alas, I'm excited to be playing as this character should be a nice, easy, smoother kind of a run. We should get, hopefully, a nice, nice gun right away. Uh, eh. Huntsman. It has a synergy. I don't know how good the synergy is, though. I really, like, I think it's a an okay synergy, if I remember correctly. Not an insane one. Other than that, like, the Huntsman's... It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's, like, upper... Upper medium. It doesn't make make me excited to get, but if it's, like, my only gun besides my starter... Sign me up. Hell yeah. I'll take it. It's a nice, defensive, pretty good damage gun. Like, it's nothing that you're gonna want to take home to mom, because she's gonna say, that's the best you could do. But it's something that you'll maybe say, like, I don't know. It, it, it's a, it's a, it's a casual friend. It's like a, a friend from work, maybe. That's what Huntsman is. It's a friend from work that you have no intention of ever seeing outside of work. You're glad it's there for when you need him. It makes the situations that are unfun a little bit more bearable, which is a gunless run. Makes them a little bit more bearable. Makes work a little bit more bearable. But you don't really want them in a, in a time of need. We want the freaking helix, though, because they get the double-double helix synergy. <clears throat> and we miss promptly all of our shots that we've ever taken with it, but you miss 100% of the shots you don't take, so... We hit exactly as much as if we didn't take any shots. <clears throat> However, we are also out two ammo, so... You lose 100% of the ammo that you miss shots on. But you also lose 100% of the ammo that you don't miss shots on. You just lose ammo. What are we getting at today? Don't you freaking worry your pretty little face about it. You wouldn't understand. We've... S there we go. We hit a shot now. Hit a shot. I think I'm just going to save it for a boss or... No, redemption tour. Actually can aim now. There we go. There we go. God, it's so good. I... I... I know people are, like, neutral on it. Some people are neutral on it. I just think the Helix is great. I think the Double Double Helix is great plus. Okay, you know what? I'm a little disappointed that I got the Dark Gun. I'll be real. Because we had it before, and it really didn't do anything for me. And I'm saying, like, it, it didn't excite me in any way. Doesn't mean it's complete garbage, but we even had we had the synergy and everything, and it just it didn't do much for me. Yeah, we take him. He's a bit chonky. He's a bit chonky means we get a little bit extra chance that we're gonna hit him with our double double helix. Stand still and dodge. Freaking E3 suckers, it's coming up, guys. What's everybody excited for? Give me okay. Question of the day. What is something that you are, like, positive is going to be at E3 that you're excited for? And what's something that you hope is going to be at E3 that you're excited for? For me? Here, like, I, I don't know. Like, I could say... I could say a lot of things, but... Uh, you know what? I'm going to swing... Jeez, uh, 
Louise. Why did I make such a hard question for myself? I'm actually probably most excited for... Oh, Luigi's Mansion 3, to be honest. May... Close, very hyper close second is uh, is Animal Crossing for me. For things that are like... Okay, and by, by definitely going to be there, I don't mean like it's been confirmed. I'm saying like things that we know exist and you want to see more about them. Like Animal Crossing and Luigi's Mansion have been confirmed to come out this year. If they're not shown off at E3, boy, oh boy, am I going to be surprised. As for... God dang it. As for things that I uh, don't know, things that we are not, that's not confirmed, let's go with a safe bet and say uh, Metroid Prime Trilogy Remastered. That'd be nice for the Switch. I'd take it. I'd be really, really hyped. That's a relatively safe unknown bet. Other than that, let's go wild. Give your boy some Pokemon Snap. Hit me with it. Ain't happening. Hit me with it. Or better yet, hit me with a uh, new good mainline Paper Mario game. That's the real not going to happen. I think Pokemon Snap is more likely at this point. But, alas. Pokemon Snap and Labo VR. Come on, you're sitting on a big old mountain of money. Big old mountain of money. Like, they're doing a decent amount more with the Labo VR stuff than I thought that they would. So, like, who knows? Pokemon Snap, you know what? I could see that happening. I could genuinely see that happening. Now that I think about it. Dang. Now I just got myself hyped and I'm not going to ever have that and I'm disappointed. They missed out on the opportunity with the, like the Wii U would have been absolutely perfect for it. Like with the gyroscope and the, the gamepad and everything. Why are they charmed? Why were they charmed? Synergy with the Trank gun? Synergy with the M1? Strange things. But yeah, that's what I'm excited about. What, what Hit me with it. What are you excited about? But confirmed and not confirmed. Or like things that have been talked about and something that hasn't been talked about. Because I am so pumped. I'm always so pumped every year. E3 is always like roughly one week before my birthday. It makes it like a double... Double... Uh, like a two-week extravaganza of, of excitement. As I've grown older, the birthdays have grown less extravaganza-esque. But, uh, we'll see. June 19th, by the way. Any, uh, any and all birthdays can be given... <laughs> birthday gifts can be given in the form of, uh, kind comments. Thank you very much. Ammo synthesizer. Shall we even bother? I guess let's just do it. It's one of those items that I truly don't... 100% know how good it really is. Let's try the drink gun again. Oh, yay. I don't know how good it really is, even. Because it's one of those... It's, it's just kind of, you know, it happens. It it happens to you. It just happens to you. Katana bullets, though. You got me all excited and hot and bothered thinking that this was the advanced, or not, the, uh, the high, high dragon fire room for some reason. I know that it wasn't going to be it. Because that room is shaped much differently. It's much longer. What do we think? Lonk. Lonk is more likely to give us a, something better than a blue chest. I. Oh, wow. Oh, wait, there's another room. Weird that that can happen. Scope. If only, if only, if only. I mean, I t I'll take it. I like the scope. I like him fine. I like him quite a bit. Oh, that was such a bad dodge. Bad dodge gone well. Ooh. SGDQ's coming up too. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. Guys, there's just so much good stuff coming up. So much good stuff on the horizon. Crash Team Racing Remastered's coming out. Oh my god. 
Oh my god. What are we gonna do, gang? What are we gonna do? Ooh. Juicy. Juicy. We haven't answered any Discord questions. All right. Pop on the uh, pop on the Discord link in the description if you want to have a question answered like I'm about to do. Little Mr. Doom asks, what do you think is the most boring gun slash passive item in Enter the Gungeon? The, I mean, the, the cheap cop-out answer for most boring, uh, boring passive is like, just say any health up. It's pretty darn boring. Other than that, uh, I would say all of the, um, all of the ones that just give you immunity to like one, one elemental type attack, they're pretty much a, they're, they're a sleeper for, for a lot of the point, a lot of point in time for me. I just kind of, eh. And even like, I, things that are potentially actively bad, like sometimes chance bullets can be actively bad or, you know, Mimic Tooth Necklace, or uh, not Mimic Tooth Necklace. Ring of Mimic Friendship, those can be actively bad, but they're at least not boring, you know? They are definitely not boring. This is doing some serious work. Hmm? Oh, look. Probably end up getting that key. Probably end up not getting anything else. I'll take a water break. Tasu no ka... Wait. I want to say it right. Tasunko Sapa. You might have decided wrong. Hey, Rita, what is your favorite childhood video game? Sorry for the typo. Don't worry about the typo. Nobody ever has to apologize about the typos. I, I could read what you mean. Don't you worry your face. Favorite childhood game? Easily, like, easily. We're talking childhood, childhood. Easily Pokemon Yellow or Super Smash Brothers for the N64. Potentially would say... Pokemon Stadium 2, though. Pokemon Stadium as well. Pokemon Stadium 2 was good, too, but Pokemon Stadium 1 hit me in those childhoods even more, though. We're talking about that. That time period. Ah! De Maria! This is just working so smooth. Like, it's not really, like, our best... Hey, look, it's a boring. Not really our best, most exciting gun or anything, but... It's making things so smooth. Just at this point in the run, the damage is doing with the katana bullets, the Kaga battle, the curse bullets even to an extent. We don't have a lot of curse, but we have a little. It's all nice. It's adding up to like a really smooth damage. And we got a really nice amount of money right now, for right now. So. It's a good run. It's a good run. Can we hit though? Boop. Just give give your boy. Oh, okay. We take that. We take that indeed. It's a it's a solid little weapon. I'm gonna leave that one on the ground. It does not get stolen because it is in a secret room. Fun fact. We haven't even done this one yet, which is my favorite. Is this... What's our best weapon for the moment? I hated that dodging. We're doing pretty good. With all the synergies, it becomes kind of a banger. I'm trying. Get him. Get him, gang. They're too afraid. Oh god, the slowdown. Forgot about that. May cause problems. Oh, oh. Get him. No. Nope. Only one actually. <laughs> You're a little late, man. Only one actually hit. I actually really do appreciate the drum clip. Kind of, like, unironically. I think it's a nice thing to get. Is it exciting? No, 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 no. Not necessarily. But I like it.
Hmm. Salad. Sure. Is it worth it to buy the ballot? I don't know. Probably not. Like, it's one of those coolness and uh, whatever the other thing I said earlier because my, my brain is so dumb. Uh, I don't know. You know, it's just... I don't know the numbers on like when they're really effective. Like how how good is it actually to buy them? I don't know. I should look it up. Figure it out. Yoink! 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 I said yoink. Pedder asks. Ped R asks. What do you think about the upgraded ruby bracelet? I need to play around with it more. People have been telling me that it's actually really good. And I believe it. I believe it. I like I liked old Ruby Bracelet in a way. And if I, somebody also told me that the old effect is still even there. And in that case, cool deal. That's right. I'm filling up the M1 sun. Oh, give me M1 sun. No seeds on the button. We'd be up in the strike. We were too. Stinger. What do we do? What do we do, synergies? Alright. Don't know. More bees? More bees? I kind of want to drop them sunglasses. I was definitely tempted to sell them at the store. We have another option to sell them here. This is just working smoothly with Katana Bullets, too, because it's just. It's a one shot bop, so you know that you're not going to be like consistently wasting. I don't know. Wasting ammo or anything. I don't like that it pushes you around. I don't like that it pushes you around. No, I don't. No, I don't. Yep. 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 Oh. I knew that could be stolen. I don't know what I was thinking there. We're pretty much just using the M1 like crazy. I think the double double helix should get a little bit more time to shine. I love this creature. This absolute beaut. Just does so much. Does so much for me. I declare June 1st double double helix day double double helix day just does so much for you whoop give your boy some silver bullets it's been a while since we've had that kind of run curse bullets silver bullets since we've had like a a cursed slayer run for lack of a better way of putting it right now a curse slayer where we get a lot of curse, but we want a lot of curse. Am I wrong? Am I wrong? I know we had a super curse run a little bit ago. I just can't remember if we had curse bullets. Like we had junk, we had junkin. We started with junkin, that, that was it yesterday or two days ago or something, the last run. Guys, absolutely big sorry, like for people watching the, these as they come out for the sporadic videos. I have literally, like I've, I've been in and out of the doctor's office, like, I know I'm, you're probably sick of hearing it. Like I, I've been talking about it for two months now. I saw talking about it for a while, but the, the problems ain't fully gone away. Problems ain't fully gone away. We still got we still got stuff to deal with. I don't know why I bought that. And it's uh, it's it's kind of dug into my time even more recently. And then, or, without going into it too deeply, because you know what? Like we've talked about it plenty. Especially because, like, all the stream VODs that are going to be going up now are, like, probably from that time. So you're going to be hearing it extra, extra. So I'm going to I'm gonna not talk about it now because you're going to be hearing about the same thing in the stream VODs. It's still going. It never stops. Maybe for my birthday it'll stop. June 19th. Never forget it.
We really shouldn't have bought a key when we... Okay, you know what? We really shouldn't have bought a key when we have uh, the drill. But I just... I don't know. Give me that Munson. No seeds on Bun we be up in this draft here? Alright. We can jetpack a bit if we feel like it. We can leave our friends behind. I tried so hard to make that work. Oh, jetpack, you fickle mistress. You pickle mistress. Pickled mistress. I'm trying to make it work. This cannot make it work. Could not make that work. Ah! Ah, uh, oh! Yeah, boy. It's not even on our head, but I'll take it. What the hell? Well, what the double hell? Are you kidding? <laughs> ah, what are you doing in the game? Why did it spawn out there? I'm, I'm actually big confused. I'm just gonna sell this for money. What else can we sell? Ah, you know what? Bite me. Who cares about that stinger life? I ain't about that stinger life. Let's sell this too. Let's go. Blow up on my toes. Let's take me. Take me. Take me, Aghanim. Twitch sub Johnny Joestar asks, what is the most disappointing gun to get for its tier? Zilla shotgun is a uh, big sad to get. All right, I gotta try this out. Ooh, Salamon! Zilla is so disappointing. Actual value from slowdown effect? Yeah, boy. This is so nice. Like, it's doing pretty good damage, and we don't even have that much accuracy right now. Oh, the slowdown plus the jetpack for the dodges in between the shots. Oh, yep. All right, this is a really fun synergy. Filling it up. Oh, okay, just walked into an enemy, that's fine. We do that sometimes. We do it from time to time. Where I like to watch you as you sleep. Is that what he sings? Whoop. I think that's the lyric. Oh, Mr. Blinkington. Blinkington 182 is his name. And nothing will change my mind. I know that's I know that's not Blink 182, but it's the it is Blinkington 182, the man's name. Tommy DeLong. Tommy Tom DeLong. <laughs> Tom that's that's what it was. Well, I mean, Tom Tom DeLonge, but I like to call him Tom DeLong. There we go. Nope. Doesn't matter. We don't need a perfect nothing. Who are we trying to who are we trying to impress? I'm just trying to do this without having to dodge. I'm really I'm curious. It seems it seems really challenging to do this one without dodging. Oh. Don't like this situation. Forgive me, master. Okay, and we're back at full. I like it. I'm gonna use the hell out of this crown of guns while we got this banging synergy and the curse bullets and everything else to make it all good and great. Huh. Oh, you, you son of a gun. Son of a gun, I've gotta be kidding me. We should really, like, every time I try to make use of the stinking jetpack, I have a horrible time. Nah, dude. Nah, dude. So I should really just stop while I'm at full health. So I can stay at full health. Oh my god. Them katana bullets, though? Ooh. 
some good amount of ammo in here. Oh. <laughs> What am I doing? It's like a indecisive Ryu from Street Fighter. What am I doing? Whoop. Yep. It just keeps getting worse. Jetpack is a recipe for disaster. Opposite of jetpack height. I'm good. So what color do they normally shoot? Are they kind of like yellowish? I know we've had this before, but I... Oh! Pretty! They're kind of like a sea foam. Or like a mint. Really did not need the drill today, so... Happy we sold it, because didn't need it. Didn't need it. Was honestly offensive to even have it offered to me. Ha! Nice. I love that I found that so that we could justify that usage. Synergy. What is this? Mjolnir! Oh, it shoots out uh, anvils. Thanks. But does it shoot out moons, though? If no, that's fine. I don't care about it. Oh. Did we get sped up? Oh, it seemed like we got sped up on the treadmill. I guess it was just because of what the hell is happening here. We got all them rings. Did we get it? Okay, I just didn't know if there was a synergy because we didn't really need... I don't really want it. Actually, you know, who cares? Who cares at this point? We, we can't get a mimic... Hubba. Bubba. Lots of fun choices there. Lots of fun choices. Disappointed we are not going to be able to get the Shadow Bullets as well. But there's a lot of fun choices there. Regardless. Regardless. It's me after it's time to put down the uh, fall decorations. It makes me regardless. Heep! Heep! Oh, I was really definitely counting on killing the sucker before he did an attack. Uh. Huh? Uh, drop it. I want Mimics. I want Mimics now. We take those. That's damage up and damage up because of Curse Bullets. Damage up because it's just what it is. And damage up because of Curse Bullets. Hey, yo. Let's go. bangers. Actually, isn't this one a, this one's a slight banger? Can't remember why. Don't know. Don't remember. Means nothing to me. Oh, it slows down bullets when you're, when it's by you? Is that what it was? Ah, shoot. Son of a gun. Stinking loot bag. Not getting any of them mimics, and that's fine. Didn't want them anyways. Really gotta drop this stinking jetpack. Dream! Oh, did you see that clutch jetpack put on? You can't make me take my finger off the mouse button. It just won't happen, gang. It won't happen. Nice try, guy.
<laughs> Did I get hit? No. The game just slowed down. Please, 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 please. Oh, we did a dumb to make it good. Sometimes a dumb makes a good, gang. All right, now we like legitimately, literally have to switch out to the jetpack. Otherwise, we're for screwed. If that ain't the damage cap, I don't know what is. Gun of the Void asks, if someone turns you into a superhero, what would be your superpower? Oh, boy. The ability to find problems anywhere. The ability to, <laughs> to discover all of the problems. And be able to solve some of them. A decent amount, like a decent puzzle solver, but way better at finding the problems than solving them. I'd be, I would just look, I would hold up my, my hand over my eyes like they do when you, you know, you're looking off in the distance. I'd say, oh, a painting is askew. Oh, stop like that. They wouldn't all be important problems. Is is the important thing to uh, to note about it? Ah, uh, yup. Yeah. No, thank you. Please, I ah, I want a freaking thing. Just want one minute. We have a really quite a bit of curse. Like a fair amount. Like an unreal amount of curse. Not really. A surprising amount of curse. Well, you're telling me this was the right way all along? I disagree. Tip tap, tip tap, tip tap, tip tap. Tip tap shape. We love it. We love it. We like it. We love it. We gotta have all of it. Whoop. It's the next step in the, uh, what is it? Is it Red Robin? Baskin Robin? Who the hell? Some place that I don't get to go. Some uh, some ice cream place. Which which is the one with the like a lot of gotta have it. it? Ain't Ben and Jerry's, is it? it? Ain't Cold Stone, is it? Is it Cold Stone? Oh. Whatever it is, it's one that I don't ever. I've never gone to the physical location of. Oh. Up. Oh ho ho ho. Yeah, we're just gonna we're just gonna take that and it's not gonna matter we don't need to worry that much I thought we had health in the bank still too I know we have chest vampirism <laughs> I'm full stop there's no there's nothing that I can say uh, to justify anything else just I know we have chest vampirism and oops is basically what I'm getting at we could get extra value out of it, but I'll be honest, I have no fears of death. I do not fear death today. Nuh uh. Not with this much, this many hearts. With this OP a build, with this OP a character. I have done a dumb. I have done a dumb, and the dang wind box pushed me into the thing. That could have been real ruthless. And it was this way all along. God, I love flight. You know, jetpack is growing on me, but only on OP builds. Only on a build that's like already OP, where you can mow through the room. Hey, ahua! Because, I mean, I love going fast and I love flying. I also love dodging. 
the goal of the game is to dodge as little as possible. You know? Like, you, I mean, obviously it's to dodge bullets and kill things, but... You don't want... It's not optimal to be dodging. You technically don't ever want to dodge, if you don't have to. You know? Because it's time that you're not shooting. It's time that you're not doing something else that's not defensive. I don't even want to open up that stinking room. It's a waste of a blank. Waste of a blank. I thought this had a synergy. Oh, no, no, no. I'm thinking of uh, the Jolter. And the Jolter has a synergy with with it. I was thinking in reverse. Fellas. Oh. Going the wrong way again. Whoop. This is it. I feel it. I feel it in my bones. I feel it in my fingers. I feel it in my toes. But then they get all freezed up in my mouth like Eskimos. I like my nose. Oh. No! Doesn't matter. It's because I took off the jetpack. Your boy forgot how to dodge. Let's see. <laughs> I tried to dodge that. What am I doing? Get this I'm stinking jetpack. Who cares about the money? We got 420 in here. We gotta get rid of that. That's an inappropriate number. To my boy, double double helix. Don't think I can do that. Get him, got him good. That is a dead second phase of the lich right there. Good aim, good aim, good aim. Uh. I'm trying so hard to do this without dodging. Oh. Yeah, I think that we're going to have to dodge this one unless we want to blank. Oh, oh, it's going to be close. I think we're good. <laughs> I just figured if you got far enough away, you'd always be able to dodge. All right, but that is going to do it. Wow. That's a dead lich right there, right there. Puts us on a streak of two... 112. 212 slash 212. Easy freaking peasy. God, gunslinger. God, that. Crown of gunslinger. All great. Holy moly. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching. Subscribe for daily and to the Gungeon videos. You're always going to get a, uh, a, a video unless I say something else. You're always going to get an end to the Gungeon video. Maybe a VOD for right now, but it may not be. It's, it's I'm trying to do a new actual Lich streak run every day, but... Health issues have been making that rough, so but I promise I'll, I'm going to try to get something up for you every single day of the Gungeon Variety, and hopefully Stardew Valley as well. I hope you guys have been appreciating that series. It's been so much fun to do. Check it out. Really, really love it. Join the Discord to ask questions you want answered in the video, like I've done today. Uh, I don't know if we're getting low, but we're, we're, we're kind of we're sort of catching up. We're, I'm, I'm perpetually pretty far behind on answering the questions, but don't let that keep you from, from asking, because I will get to them. Um, but what else? What else? Join the Discord. I already said that. Follow me on twitch.tv slash Retromation. Catch me streaming games live. I usually start every stream, at least start every stream with Enter the Gungeon. And then move on to something else. Go check that out. Newly partnered, so I'm gonna. there's going to be some flexible stuff over there. You can see Enter the Gungeon and more over on that. Hell, follow me on Twitter, RetromationYT. I tweet sometimes. I, major, major 
like updates to the channel go there. Uh, my thoughts on new gaming news goes there. And then if I ever find like niche new indie games you might not s see otherwise, I share them over there as well. That's the kind of stuff you'd find on my Twitter. But alas, I think that's it. Thank you for watching. Thank you. Thank you. See you next time.